And there's the bide we leaving the Polark. I can't see what the grey boat is that's going. slowly closing the upbound lock gates. You see this one is just starting to move out. They don't move very fast, but it's actually moving out. Okay, so they, they were nearly closed, and <laughs> then they decided to reopen them. So they must be expecting a, a boat coming down from the upside. Uh, well, they were just testing them, something like that. We're on the viewing platform and the boat coming in is the Algoma Bear. So we'll get some more clips of that as it comes across the docks, locks. And they seem to be raising this jackknife bridge, I think they call it. It's very, very slowly opening. almost imperceptible but it is opening and I, I don't know why because no boats can go through there anyway now Goma Bear is still getting in position and one of the boat tour lot boats is coming back so they're getting a good look at it too so the holiday two lot boat tours just arrived Look up the lock gates are closed, so very shortly they're going to be empty in the lock and start going down. And it's going to drop 21 feet. As you can see, the uh, water level's down quite a bit now. And there's the tour boat, the, the roof is below the level of the towpath, that's what they still call it. I've got a feeling the, uh, they might be untying soon, or as soon as they open the lock gates. Okay, I think it's down to the bottom now, because I can see a crack forming in the lock gates up here. So with it open like that, that must be the lowest level, so they'll untie the boat as soon as they get the doors open. Then it'll be on its way. So the Algoma Bear is still on approach. But I see in the distance, there's yet another freighter heading, and it looks like it's heading in for the steelworks. This will be the second one I've seen of these head in there. They are really stockpiling for winter. In the meantime, the boom is going up for the Sioux Locks. To take the ropes off, the tour boat can leave. And this is the Algoma Bear coming in. About one mile an hour, it's just a slow stroll, especially for those guys with the tow ropes. Yeah, it is actually moving. Not to tell, it takes a long, long time. They have to be very careful. There he is moving in. So quite a few scrapes on it. roped off and it is now dropping 
very slowly of course. There's something you don't see every day. Da 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 And there goes the Algoma Bear down the St. Mary's River. Around the corner and off. Bye.